Good morning, Annie. Yeah, you can see here on Storm Tracker 4, we're starting to see some light rain not only in the North Bay, but crossing the Golden Gate Bridge, heading into San Francisco, and it looks like we're picking up some light rain for our East Bay Interior Valleys. So as we zoom in here on Storm Tracker 4, you can see the areas of yellow. Those are pockets of heavy rain right now impacting your ride uh, just north of Petaluma, down toward Novato and the Highway 37 interchange. You can see the heavier rain actually crossing the Richmond San Rafael Bridge and then heading along the East Shore Freeway. As we zoom here on San Francisco, Daly City, Colma, South City, all contending with some light rain. This is crossing the bay, making its way into the Oakland and Alameda areas. Light rain also for the Dublin Interchange, Pleasanton, even as far east as Brentwood. But this is really just the first wave of rain we're dealing with right now. Not too much on the back end of this, so we could actually catch a dry break for the next couple of hours. But more intense rain definitely on the way for your evening commute home. Now let's walk you through the day on Futurecast 4. You'll notice by 12 o'clock, mostly just some light rain along the coastline, the mid peninsula, maybe as far east as Hayward and Fremont. But as we put the clock into motion by three o'clock this afternoon, the rain intensifies north of the Golden Gate Bridge. We'll continue to see intense showers by seven o'clock this evening. In fact, we are dealing with the possibility of perhaps severe weather. We could see a line of thunderstorms along the coastal ranges. So all the ingredient ingredients really in place for that. But you'll notice the rain starts to taper off, becomes scattered in nature as we wake up early Thursday morning. So Thursday morning, we'll be dealing with wet roads, but it looks like we should see drier conditions into the afternoon. Now, of course, whenever we see rain in the Bay Area, that usually translates into snow in the Sierra. So we are looking at a winter weather advisory going into effect later this afternoon. Snow level expected at 7,000 feet at lake level. We could see between three and six inches of fresh new powder above 7,000 feet. More impressive amounts. In fact, we could see up to 18 inches of snow. So bring your chains if you're headed in that direction. Here's a look at your seven day round the bay forecast storm number two right on our heels that arrives Friday morning that will carry us into the weekend mostly cloudy conditions gusty winds up to 40 miles per hour partly cloudy skies however just a slight chance for rain as we start the next work week